Hey, it's me, Peter, and this is the fourth and final Advent vlog installment. Okay, let's review. The first one we did, in the first week of Advent, we talked about loving your family. And that was about being very intentional about the more people you do life with. To not just say it, but even do something. Spend time with them. Make a space for them to remind them how important they are to you. And then the second weekend we said love your neighbor and that meant more than just waving at them and saying hi and wishing them a Merry Christmas, but actually being intentional, serving them, doing something for them, being a blessing to them in some way, somehow. And then the third Advent week, we said to love someone you don't know. Maybe someone who is on the other side of the world and we even specifically invited you to sponsorship through Compassion International. And for those of you who actually went to my website and sponsored a child through Compassion, I say thank you, because those children are getting something that is greater than Christmas. They're gonna get an opportunity and even hope to a new life. So, we did the first three, so what's the fourth one? It might sound a bit cliche, but the fourth Sunday of Advent is love Jesus. Now stay with me. Reason being is that you actually did it. When you loved your family, you were loving Jesus. Those are the people that God gave you. When you were loving your neighbor, you were loving Jesus because scripture says, love the God with our heart, soul, mind, and strength. And then he says, love your neighbor as yourself. Two of the greatest commandments that Jesus gave us. All right, and the third one, children, sponsoring children. Jesus said in the least of these, he says, I am there. So then we find ourselves in the fourth Sunday and being loving Jesus. How do we do it? Really, it's about being intentional. It's about going to the stable. It's about when you worship, being very purposeful, not just in your routine of what you're doing, but actually going and singing to Him, praying to Him, thanking Him. And then you remember Him when you, and love Him when you start remembering what it is about. This is when God began a plan to show His love for us and to save our lives. For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whoever believed, if you want to love Jesus, believe Jesus, trust him, believe in him in every moment, do it differently than you did before, and even ask him, say, Jesus, how can I be more like you and less like myself? All right, appreciate you all who continually uh, are a part of our Advent Devos, and I hope you have a blessed and merry Christmas. See you.